Hello everybody, welcome back to Hand of Fate 2. Last episode we did Strength. Um, I still need to go for gold on this one. Um, but let's try the Devil again. And I've been giving this one some thought on how to go about things. Um, I think we need to give the potion to the one guy, but then we need to find a way to that castle at the end. Um, so the way I think we go about this, um, let's clear everything here. Right, let's see what we went with. Um, that's looking fine. Which is our companion? Ariadne, right? Yeah. So can we put that in? We can't, so there's no real point in doing this one unless we're going for the gold token. Um, well, we might as well then add this one in so we know what that one does. Um, we can't put in brimstone cards, which is a bit unfortunate. Let's try Trading House, which means we'll get rid of this one to put that one in. And I'll get rid of you because it didn't really help me all that much. And we'll put in uh, our Ogre guy again. No way, we need to put something in that can teleport. Um, map Add seems like that could do it. Um, was there also one that could... We play encounter. I don't think we want to do that. Was there also one that like fills the map? I think it was also something desert related. Um, I think it was also something desert related though, wasn't it? Map add, yeah. I think there was something in here that was called like map fill or something. If you do not want to make a decision, let the goblin do it and we'll be on our way. Shush you. I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Put in uh, the desert one then. It has a token. We might as well see what's out there. I think we have to fail at it. Okay. So I think this one is going to be a little bit uh, sketchy at best. Let's see what we start with here. Five food, five gold. Worker's hammer. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. I envy your friends. It has been an eternity since I traveled with like-minded associates. Okay. I'm sorry, Adne is ill. Here's a token for you, if you can earn it. Let's see if we can do this token. Could it seem like a good idea to get this? And then forfeit. Let's see what we get. Um, trade food for equipment. You lack prominence to use this weapon. Gain more fame. And then trade equipment for food.
Okay, so we lost like one food or something, well, but we did gain yeah. the token. I guess we can just carry on. Yeah, yeah, Lord of Polyon. Okay. Might as well get our blessings in early. Play the game, should... Ooh. We... Don't have the blessings, yes. Okay. I need to be a little bit... Slower on this, I guess. Alright. Cool. Uh, we get this guy. Proper plague wool. Check our inventory. We have the hammer, so we will go for the f food. <sighs> the other idea I have is that if we can skip using him once, we may have a small chance of victory. If we don't use his service four times, like, we'll get one success card. If we, like, get the money for the thingamajigamabob. Yes, that one. Well, I nearly start off hitting the wrong button. This is why I don't like you guys. You know, we have that shield up. Alright, come on. I guess we'll try for you guys first. But you guys are gonna get the brunt of the uh, supers every single time. can rest assured on that. Right, come on, let's go bash this guy up. There goes another one. Just immediately bash, we probably have to do that anyway. Spell of combat, but we gained some. That hand was in a weird position. Just gonna say that. I hope it was still attached to the guy. Otherwise, this is bad on right. Food, food, food. Alright, for fame. No wonder you, your holy people, cannot heal her. We should be fine. There we go. Yeah, moving on. This is where we save Malaclips? Yeah, I'm stuck. Exploration is at the heart of what we do. We find and cherish the new, the fresh, and the unknown. So we wanted this one on an other one. Yeah, so I think we will reset. If you get this on the final one, we're pretty much set. Okay, so yeah, let's forfeit. It's still early on, it's alright. 
And we can uh, get rid of the gambling or the trading house as well, see what we get for that one. Okay, good, good. We're, we're starting to get it. Could use the trading house again, scouting party. Huh? It's gonna be a bit annoying that we need to get lucky enough to get that one card on the good one, but um, not much we can do. Um, let me see one thing quickly. Hmm. Odd. Uh, it's nothing game related, but anyway. Um, yeah, we wanted to get rid of the gambling uh, trading house. Why don't we go with gambling house? Mm. Um, do you have any more tokens we need to get? So we could get Cheerful Woodcutter, but we need a ton of cash for that. We have Goblin Time in our deck, so it's possible that we can get it. Okay. Um, I suppose it's possible that we could get enough Blessings. We start with one Blessing, then we get the, this one. That's two Blessings. We don't have many cards to go on anyway, so it's... Yeah, we need to get this one and, um, say, Helpful Priest or something. Maybe we have two shots, so... I doubt this will work. Yeah, we'll just go with this. So now it begins. I'm assuming this is going to be a rather segmented run with a lot of restarts because we need that desert trek on the f last encounter. These are the challenges I want you to learn to face. Callus may have done anything. He may have created any sort of new rule, any new concept. You must learn to defeat even the impossible. Buddy. Yeah, why not? I think this one is the huge one. Why did I attract the huge one? Well, because I'd rather have failure than the huge failure. Uh, and I'd rather avoid huge failure than get success. Deals with the guild. No, let's see. I can only think this will end poorly for both of us. I guess your better judgment is to pick the Thieves Guild for their patronage to help fund the journey ahead. Some of the guild members are sympathetic towards your cause and offer support in the future. Deal will add your selected game cards to the deck. Oh. Eh, not that great. Something different there in our blessing. Something about Revive Companion? Yeah, we didn't have this one yet. We had the one with the pendulum. If I were at the beginning of each new map. Alright, so again, we need to get lucky enough to not get 
the desert trek. Which I... If we go here, do we get map reveal? Yeah, we do. Okay, so it's not in here. That's good. The woodcutter requires a lot of gold. We do have that. Haggle over Thorn's asking price. Back to the bones. I hope you have learned to be their master. I wanted to roll. Hmm. Idiot. Oh well. So much for trying that other option, huh? Of uh, just paying the ransom for Colbjorn. the end of this challenge before you starve to death. I'd love Time to, but... Will tell. I do you have anything of equipment-wise you wish to shell. We'll soon be able to wear this. If we sell that, we can buy some food. Eh, we'll wait. Okay. Sure, we'll transport. Approach the village, meet the fame. Saying, I've got the power. If we don't get the desert thing here, we're in a good spot. Uh, I think I'll go for the food. Uh, do we have a shield? No, we don't. We have another... What do we need for this one, anyway? Oh. Well, I guess we'll get that token. Uh, we will refuse to kill the poppers, because we need food. Free food, the best kind of food. So I have your belief. Does things really be are things really better when you get them for free? Facing me isn't that brilliant of a move either. Well, let's hope we just get to find some more. Um, a empire. Food, 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 food. All 
Alright, you can have my blessing. You can have allies return. Steady hearts. And... I guess you can take Fate's Path. It doesn't matter if we uncover it or not uncover it. We need it to be in the... final bit. I mean, even if we don't uncover it here, if it is here, it's mucked up anyway. So yeah, take Fate's Path too. Um, sure, we'll defend him. And then we have to search him, right? And then we get a ring or something? Do you block? I don't think you do, because you're... Lacking a shield. Oh wait, you don't even have armor. Why would I even bother trying to bash you? Shoot someone else in the face, would you? And the helmet casually rolls to the side. Search Hansel. Nope. Uh, I think this. Wait, 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 wait. Let me check map again. Yeah, so this has to be a polyon, no? Yes, okay, so we should be good, I think. I hope. Hmm. Okay, thanks. Alright, so this is the last one of these gambits we'll hopefully have to do. Um, sure. Cool. Now we spend some money and fail regardless. All right. So if you now get that map fill, we should be able to just wander off to the castle thing. Polyon, we don't want to go there. Hmm. Um, let's sell you. And you. How much food can that get me? Not much, but we'll buy as much as we can regardless. Can I relieve? Losing the helm is eh, annoying, but one drunken night. Okay. That map thing better show up though. <laughs> May have a bit of a problem otherwise. Thing here? No. Well, now that I know there's 10 food here, I kind of feel like an idiot, but we couldn't have known. The noms. Oh, 
Yeah, so that one coming. Well, there's a health chest anyway, so... It's alright. Another blemish on my record, though, but... Last thing we need to do for the potion. We just have to take it from him, don't we? Desert track, there we go. Fill up that beautiful map. There we go, we can just wander off towards that uh, thing. Next element of Max is approaching, he begins without uh, me to travel or... Oh yeah, we need to trade for the... Trade for an angel feather. Uh, no. Magic with a dwarf feather is probably fake. Or is better out of sight when you feel suddenly beside you saying the dwarf has never had such a valuable price in his possession, perhaps never will again. Now it is time for spell to be completed. My flash returns to normal at last. For all these years, I'll be free. You launch towards reach the vibe, but you feel it's already opening it. The pendulum is ever changing, and the challenges it presents change too. Uh, Ask Deacon explains himself. Like you, once full of purpose and inflated sense of destiny, I dare to take my, stake my soul on a card game. The slaves in the Fort Empire formed before even the Dragon Slayers waged a war. I've seen done things that would drive you to madness. Without a vial, I shall cover countless lifetimes more. Have it. You give it to me willingly. I do not know your every deed and exploit, hero, but I do know that this is the greatest mercy you will ever perform. If you assume the concept of vial, and now I have one last game to play that I may win my freedom, he says as he fades away. And screw you, Polyon. Now. How will you fare with the desolation you've uncovered? No. So we do wish to fail one. Let's give that a go. The endless wastes have their own way of focusing. The Before mind. we do the we begin to notice the more subtle nuances. Uh, no, we want our companion. I want to win this one so that the cards can be removed, if that makes sense. But I will happily fail one now. Even if it's just to try and get the token. Continue. Come lost but find your way again after only a day. Fun vague These notes. tokens represent the expansion of the game. More options, more cards, more opportunities. Scroll on your map, your journey through the deserts. Now there's a huge failure. I'll go for success though and end this. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um see if we can buy anything. I highly doubt it, but Breath has I over seventy-eight. Yep. The Empire has stood in your path at every step, yet now there is no velvet over the iron. They would kill you 
to achieve their goals. Your spot as you approach and remove the well guarded Empire Fort. Call to arm raised from the walls and ballistic start your advance. Your soldiers block the path ahead. Oh, we don't get the uh, 100 HP. Okay. So we're gonna have to be a little bit careful here, is what you're telling us. Hmm. shame if he died here, but we know how to deal with things. If I die here, we'll probably jump back to once I get back here. I don't think there's many tokens left that I would need to get. The amount of people is dwindling though, so... Okay, I think there's only one musket boy left. See what our tokens get us. Uh, our one token. But uh, like I said, we will uh, jump back. Nicely done. <laughs> Nicely done. Oh, thanks. That solved so little. It has ended this, however. Free token ain't bad though. Anyway, let's see what we get. Now skip back until I get here. It might be a while because you know I have to get lucky again for the desert trek to be here. What is the map called again? Desert Crossing, okay. For paying Thon or Dahl. Forest Guardian Ring. Return to Deadly Forests. Crossing the Desert. Cave of Wonders. Proving no shield is an obstacle against the hammer. We get Spiked Mace. Not bad. Could have gone better, but. Anyway, see you when I get back to this. But unless something interesting happens along the way, you never know. See you in a bit. Right, so um, a little in-between thing. Um, I did get that ring in our deck, and we managed to grab it thanks to Elder's Gift. I've also got the Deadly Forest in my deck. Um, with a bit of luck, we'll encounter that. Um, and if we do, I'll get back to you. So I'll keep on going until I find Deadly Forest, um, even if I find that Desert Trek thing in the meantime, because you know it is for a token. Anyway, see you in a bit. Hopefully with Deadly Forest. Well, found it. Warm glow from the ring provides you with some reassurance as you brave the woods once more. The forest is eerily still unseen. Watchers scrutinize you from the shadows. The breeze rises into a howling gale, buffeting you with debris. Dark leaves from the forest floor dance and spin in the squall, forming a face. I see my ring finds a new bearer. Do you ache for adventure or are you a quaint little gardener like the last one? Ask about the forest. The heart of the forest lies a weapon of terrible power. Whether the forest grew around it as a safeguard or it was placed in the forest as a deterrent, none can say, but the weapon is here and so I am its guardian. This weapon was meant to be lost and forgotten, but I see how the world has changed beyond the bounds of my forest. If I could find a great warrior, someone truly worthy, perhaps I could entrust it with the blade. Well, we do have 50 fame thanks to the devil one. 
horse spirit scoffs. Oh, of course, you say you're a worthy and good hero. I guess I'll just take your word for it and hand over this powerful weapon. Thanks. <laughs> you must prove your worth, complete the weapons trials, and perhaps you will be deemed worthy. Perhaps now be gone. Wind picks up once more, engulfing you in fallen leaves. You clutch your ears to block the noise. When the roaring dies down, you find yourself once again at the edge of the forest. Old, weathered, and still a viable hunk of metal. Defeat 15 enemies during a single challenge to win this token. Hmm. That's a lot of enemies. Um... In any case, uh, this quest is bogus because we've already gotten the um, actual desert trick. So we'll forfeit this one and we'll see what that token is. I'm assuming it's the Cartridge's God, but we may as well check, right? It's too bad this takes forever. Turn the deadly forest, bearing the magical ring, gain the questing base. Yes. I hope that's a thing we can uh, start with. Yep. See you when I get to the end. Right, so here we are. Final leg. Um, and we got the desert trek on the correct one. So it's good. I'm a lot more prepped for combat now. Let me tell you why. I did some deck building. And let me show you what I put into the deck. The Lionheart. Basically 150 health at my disposal. And if that's not enough, I also took Healing Spirits to start off with. Um, in any case, it shouldn't be too bad to... The damage taken from starvation is more than the healing delivered by eating. I totally As forgot with many those things. Food. We find ourselves sliding further and further. We have the experience, so I don't really care much. Uh, is there a food chest? There is. So let's just grab that one and we'll be on our merry way. There's not much left in this channel for us anyway, so. You guys, I can check if I can buy any more better equipment, like a piece of armor or something. Yeah, nope, starvation with help and we got some food for the final bit of our journey we do have to get through the desert i guess so maybe we should buy a little bit more food but we got healing spirits meaning we can start three times so let's actually check what we can buy at camp Platinum suit. Well, now I just feel silly for not getting the extra cash. Didn't know it was going to be that expensive, though. All right. Uh, we still need to give that potion to that one person. What if we... Sell the Imperial armor. And then we would have enough for... Or sell this and healing spirits. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, you're selling it for a lot cheaper. Okay, let's get it. So the camp things are more expensive. Alright, this is where we get our thing done. Uh, Trader for Angel Feather. No. Continue. Alright. This shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, 
We'll ask him to explain himself. And then give him the vial. I just have to get through the desert now. No. Lucky me. One bad one and I managed to get it. Great if you got this one. It's only getting worse. Ah, oh, good. We can move. That one final inventory check. With his eye, line, hard platinum suit. Start advance, match 50% life. That matters little, because we can just use our artifact to gain more health. Should be an easy fight now. I'm guessing that's gonna be gold for this one. Unless it is indeed having to do it through. Um, not taking one deal from a polyon, meaning that you can do this one without shenanigans. Uh, let's actually have a sip of our artifact. Wow, shot point blank in the face. That had to hurt. I see why we wouldn't. Kind of impressive that the musketeer guys have no problem shooting through their own companions. I don't think that's somebody I would want to have on my team. Not sure what you guys think about that, but um, that's what I'm going with at least. Thought might as well have another sick break. We're at the end anyway. May as well end up with a lot of health. Stink eye for me because they know I'm recording. I'd rather not have it. I'm just like, oh, not this Cool. All right. Let us see if we gained gold here. We 
The bird is already feasting on a greater part of the fort's garrison. You gain access, easy access to the fort and look at the inner cell. Yes. Get information. Powerful enemies. Later at night, the Ophelia appears from the darkness. Thank you, friends. With your help, I have at least gained my freedom. Perhaps one day I can return a favor. Yep. Got it. Nice. You are beginning to see your way around the edges of our game, to peek beyond. Together, I think we will stand against the usurper. Mark of damnation. That's gold on the devil. Nice. I guess we'll go back to strength on the next one. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Hope you're in the series of free shows. Probably coming like him or something. We've had already. I'll see you guys all in the next episode. Bye, everyone.